Hi, my name is Nazia Tako and I'm a PhD student at the Pabright Institute. My area of research is looking at whether um, immunity to existing viruses through vaccines or infection can also protect against emerging viruses, either known or unknown. My day-to-day -day activities involve a lot of lab work, so this can include cell culture activities or uh, prepping samples, but can also include attending meetings or data analysis. I undertook an undergraduate degree in medical sciences at the University of Birmingham, after which I then did a master's degree in immun immunology and immunotherapy at the University of Birmingham. I started working at the Powerbright Institute as a research assistant, but then transitioned to a PhD through here. So I'm now on the uh, University of Oxford doctoral training programme, which Powerbright Institute is a par partner institute um, within the programme. So if I was a research assistant, I was very much um, producing data towards a larger study to meet the research goals of, um, of, a, of a large cohort. But I feel that as a PhD student, I can very much drive my own research and focus my research on things that I want to do and have more autonomy over the work that I do. So the academic affairs team at the Perbar Institute have really helped in streamlining my transition from an RA to a PhD student. So I really enjoyed taking part in the social club aspects that are available at the Institute and I feel that especially as a research assistant that's become a student that's helped me integrate more with the, the, the other students at the Institute. I also enjoy attending the weekly seminars at the Institute, so these are held twice a week and it's a good opportunity to listen to the research output that's um, being conducted across the Institute but also from external um, scientists. So there are many training opportunities available to students at the Institute, but I also like that the Institute are very supportive of students undertaking training off-site and are also able to help cover the costs of this. So I would advise that you choose an area that you're interested in. Um, so the Powerbright Institute is a great establishment for working on viruses and livestock and zoonotic diseases, um, which is something that I really enjoy. So I'm not quite sure what I'd like to do in the future, but I feel that the experience that I have now as a scientist will put me in a good standing to be able to decide that in the future. My favourite thing about being a scientist is the research that I'm doing having a positive impact on society. So I've especially enjoyed over the past year and a half being actively involved in the COVID-19 research that's taken place within the Institute. And one of the cool things that I've been able to do is be part of a, a podcast and was interviewed by the academic armchair to be involved in this. Although doing a PhD can seem like quite a challenging and daunting process, you do learn a lot along the way and you find that you make some good friends and have some lifelong colleagues that help support you.